The Last of Us, HBO's adaptation of the popular video game, is finally here, and the first episode is a stunner. Spread across multiple time periods, the episode beautifully gives context for the deadly virus to come, explores the sickening hardships of one main character, and begins to tease the story of the second. The Mandalorian's Pedro Pascal stars as Joel, a father who, on the day the virus begins, loses his daughter in the most horrific of circumstances. The sequence leading up to it plays out with intensity and visuals similar to the video game the show is based on, with third-person point-of-view camera angles and huge visual effects. It's a lot. Flash forward 20 years later and Joel is in Boston. He's scraping together a living and hoping to find his brother, Tommy, who has stopped communicating with him for some reason. Joel and his partner, Tess, hatch a plan to go find him. Meanwhile, a young girl named Ellie, played by Game of Thrones' as Bella Ramsey, has been captured by a resistance group called the Fireflies. Apparently, she's very important for some reason. Why exactly? If you've played the game, you already know, but the first episode of the show merely hints at it, which only adds to the tension. Director and co-showrunner Craig Mazin does a fantastic job showcasing the massive world the series will explore, while also making the characters feel realistic and vulnerable. The performances definitely help drive that too. There's action intrigue, and lots of smart, subtle world building. Just look at the way the first few scenes in Boston play out, with posters offering crucial information and a shocking reveal involving a small child. From the first moment of the episode all the way to the last, you can simply tell The Last of Us is being adapted with a level of care video games are rarely, if ever, afforded. We're extremely excited to see where things go from here because the first episode of The Last of Us really got our attention. To read more about this episode, check out gizmodo.com io9.